What's up, big timers? Today we're getting a close up look at the Tarmac Works Lamborghini Aventador SV police cars. Let's go ahead, open these up, and get a close up look at them. Alright guys, here they are, the Tarmac Works Lamborghini Aventador police cars. Check them out, some great looking police cars. And these are from a somewhat newer company, Tarmac Works. These cars cost you around the $8 mark US a piece. So let's go ahead and open these ones up and kind of get some good detail on what these are all about. We'll open up this one first. They're officially licensed cars. You can see they've got all the Lamborghini logos on there. They're all official. So let's go ahead and open this one up. And this one, here we go. Check out the packaging, that's crazy. It's got like this kind of bubble right there to hold the car into place. And we'll go ahead, we'll take the car out. And the car is actually even submerged fully in two bubble packs, which is really unique. I've never seen that before. We'll put it down for a second here. We'll take a look at the box. So this is just a box where you can kind of display it in, kind of similar to Matchbox style, but uh, definitely more detailed. We'll put that one aside for a second and we'll take a look at the actual car itself. So this is the Lamborghini police car. Uh, it's police uh, I'm not sure, it's maybe French. Correct me if I'm wrong here, but uh, there it is. You can see kind of the nice detail on the side of it. One thing that I noticed right away is uh, these side mirrors are like, they're like rubber or plastic attached on there. So that's kind of cool, that's kind of different. Uh, maybe it looks a little bit more realistic, but you probably want to be careful that they don't break off. Um, and check it out from the back. Wow, check, I love the Lamborghini Aventador SV, it's one of my favorite cars of all time, has the Highway Patrol, the cool diffuser that we have right there, the Aventador SV. Check out the detail from the top of it as well. Great looking car, great quality. And these ones, the wheels and tires do roll, but uh, this is mainly meant for display. They're not really meant for playing with, although these ones you could. Um, from the bottom, you can see right there, it's just a full plastic base on there. And then we've got the metal body. There's the front end of this one. Great looking car, very, very nice. And from the side as well. Wow, I love the Aventador SV. Love it, love it, love it. Great looking car. All right, we'll put this one down there for a second. We'll take a look at the other police one. This one definitely more defined black with the white side and also all officially licensed, of course, from Tarmac Works. Let's go ahead, open this one up. Get a nice look at this one here. Put that packaging aside, love the packaging. So much work has gone in. Even the cheaper versions of the Tarmax Works cars, these ones are such great packaging, great quality. So we'll put the box aside. You guys saw the box of the other one, no need to see that. And here's that crazy packaging of this one. I mean, we'll take that little thing off. We'll take the car out and we'll take that one down at the bottom there. And there it is, Police Aventador SV. Check it out, black with the white on it. And again, these side mirrors are these kind of stuck on like rubberish plastic. But wow, that is, that's one of the best looking one in 64 scale police cars I think I ever have seen. It has to be. That is awesome, the Aventador SV. Black, so it's kind of hard it's to, to see all the lines, being that it's a black car, because black kind of hides a lot of the lines, but by no mistakes, this one is done very right, very proportionate, and looks very, very realistic. Great looking car, absolutely love this one. Um, I'm gonna grab a Lamborghini Aventador Hot Wheels and show you guys for a comparison. All right, so we've got the black Lamborghini Aventador from Hot Wheels and we've got a silver one. I'll actually probably put the black one down for a second. We'll compare the silver one because you can see the lines a lot better in the silver one. So let's go ahead and take a look with the white one. And uh, we are not comparing completely apples to apples, but very close because this is the Aventador, that's the Aventador SV. So very close, one in 64 scale. But you can see Tarmac Works detail on cars is definitely better, it's higher quality than the Hot Wheels variations. But then again, these are not really toys. These are more display pieces. 
I mean, like I said before, you can use these as toys, but um, these ones will probably be not as durable as the Hot Wheels, being the Hot Wheels is kind of an all metal body, doesn't have the mirrors on here, so there's nothing really to, to break off. They can take a bit more of a beating, but for display purposes, I mean, it, just check it out in comparison. There's really no comparison. The detail on the Tarmax Works ones is definitely top quality. And very, very nice. I'm, I'm really wishing that Hot Wheels would come out with an Aventador SV, but I'm very glad that I have a 1 in 64 scale Aventador SV. Uh, let's take a look at the black ones here so we can kind of compare as well. Um, kind of hard to see the lines of the black ones, but you get the point. The Tarmax Works ones are definitely high-end, high-quality cars. There you go. Very, very nice. All right, guys, uh, I'll throw some links down below if you guys are interested and you wanna check out current pricings. Like I said, right around this video, these ones will run you about $8 a piece. You can order them online, but uh, Tarmax works great. Detailed castings of cars. Really, really liking these ones. Thanks a lot for watching this one, guys. If you like this video, throw this video a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed, subscribe, and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye-bye. What's up, Peak Timers? This is your boy Phil from Peak Time Racing. I just wanna thank you all for watching this video. Now, I just wanna make sure you guys are fully aware of the Peak Time Racing brand, which consists of all three of these channels right here. We've got Peak Time Racing, which is the channel you're on right now. We've got Peak Time Vlogs, which is my vlogging channel where you can find more stuff about my daily life, my family, and a lot more behind the scenes things, as well as Peak Time TV, which is my gaming channel. Mix Mixed in with a little bit of a storyline channel with Hot Wheels, some really cool stories and Hot Wheels stuff in there as well. I just want to make sure you guys don't miss out on a video that I post, so be sure to subscribe to all three of those channels. I will be doing a monthly giveaway and all you have to do to enter is post on any one of my videos and any one of my channels that you are subscribed to all three of the Peak Time Racing branded channels. I'll be picking one lucky winner each month at random who will receive a prize package of Peak Time Racing branded things as well as Hot Wheels. Thanks again for watching this one. I'll catch you guys on the next video. Bye-bye.